She's a mama. Hi everyone, it's Bunny. Today I'm going to show you guys how I do my entire face with only one eyeshadow palette. It is a trick I learned when I was in high school when I couldn't invest a lot of money in makeup. So I learned to make the best with what I got. The things I invested in were foundation, powder, eyeliner, eyeshadow palette, and a lipstick. My roommates were asleep when I was filming this video so I had to be really quiet. So let's get started. First, foundation. Here I am using the Double Lasting Foundation SPF 34 from Etude House and I'm going to apply it with my Beauty Blender. When I was in high school, I used to have severe acne and instead of investing on concealers, I just bought a very good foundation that I can layer on so it can work as a concealer. Back then, makeup for me was a tool, so I made sure everything that I own can be multifunctional and convenient. There must be something bad Especially if you're on a budget, make sure to invest in multifunctional products. In this video, I will be using the eyeshadow palette from Wallers & Cosmetics. It is a Mongolian brand. Yay! Alright, now we are going to contour our face with a brown shade. With the edge of your beauty blender, dip into the brown shade and start contouring. The key is to blend. Back in high school, I used to have this four shade eyeshadow palette from Daiso Japan. If you guys don't know what Daiso Japanese is, it's a Japanese drugstore and they sell very cheap makeup. What I liked about it was that it was really easy to use and it helped me achieve that natural look that I wanted. So if you guys are not interested in investing a lot of money or buying a palette with many colors, maybe check this one out. I will not say it is the best, but it does get the job done. And you can use it how I use the Wallerson palette in this tutorial. I contour my cheeks, neck, forehead, and nose. And with the powder, set everything in place. Make sure to use powder after contouring your face to make everything look natural. Otherwise, you're gonna have harsh lines and it will look like you just put dirt on your face. Next, I'm going to use the soft orange shade as my base for my eyelid. go into the same brown shade and contour my eyelid to give it more depth. Get back 
and then eyeliner. Here I am using the BK001 Liquid Eyeliner by BC. This, uh, I don't know how to pronounce it. Anyways, if you guys are interested in how I do my eyeliner, go check out my previous video, Basic Eyeliner Knowledge for Beginners. And then later, brush your eyebrows. And use the black shade with an angular brush and start filling in them. Make sure to put a little amount of product first because black is a very extreme color and you may overdraw it. So it is best to layer them one by one slowly. Afterwards, brush them out to make them look more natural and then finish it off by curling your eyelashes and applying mascara. I am using the Colossal Go Extreme Leather Black Mascara by Maybelline. For blush, I'm going to use this maroon shade and blend it out. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something that feels. And with the white shimmery eyeshadow, I'm gonna highlight my cupid's bow, nose. Once you get to meet her, you see her walking down the boulevard. She got the posture of a superstar. The inner corner of my eye. She looks so fly in those Gucci slides. Eyebrow bone. I wonder where she hides under her disguise. Yeah, 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 yeah. And all the girls around the world, they want to be yeah. And all the dudes are trying to score like it's fever. She lives a double life. And my cheeks. So, what's under the subtle smile? We'll never know. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to And at last, apply lipstick that matches your natural lip color. Mine is Pearl 420 Blush Lipstick from Revlon. Deeper once you get to meet her. She's a Mona Lisa. Then you are done. To anyone who is interested in makeup, it is meant to be played and experiment with. You don't need to buy everything on the market to get started. For a basic everyday look, sometimes all you need is a simple eyeshadow palette. I hope you guys enjoyed my tips and leave on the comment section below your favorite multifunctional beauty item. I'm gonna list all of the things I use in this video on the description below. And don't forget to like and subscribe my channel and my Mongolian channel, The Orion. And I'll see you guys next time. You be looking fine, so no wonder they can match that Louis V scar for I'm chilling with a dad. Whoa, slow it down like that. Just hold me down like that. Yeah. She's a mom.